Paula Abdul and Ahmad Rashad. Tonight on Friday Night Videos. Videos. Now, our guest tonight is a lady who is, is solely responsible for the Lakers winning record at home because when she was a cheerleader, all the other teams would come there and they'd be so distracted by her beauty that they couldn't play. They couldn't shoot. Their shooting percentage went down. And oh, I found God. out it was a plot to have her do that. And it worked. Well, it was a plot, Ahmad. I mean, Magic and Cream did send the Laker girls over to the visiting bench every time it was an important game. And, you know, it kind of worked, but uh, what can I say? As I traveled around the country, all the players would say, hey, man, Paula Abdul was out there dancing. Forget the game. we got to see her. She's getting paid major bucks. No, that's not right. true. And now everybody can see her because she's so talented. She not only dances, she sings, she choreographs, she can do everything. And she's got a hot album, a lot of hot hits out right now. We're going to see more of Paula Abdul tonight, so don't go nowhere. Tonight on a special holiday edition of Friday Night Videos, your hosts are Paula Abdul and Ahmad Rashad. We'll have broadcast premieres from Tom Petty, Joe Cocker, and Michael Bolton, plus... Paula Abdul and pump up the jam from Technotronics. And now Paula Abdul and Ahmad Rashad. You know, Ahmad, I promised everyone that I'd get you to dance, but uh, you seem to be giving me a hard time. Well, here. see, I have a problem like so many other people do, and some people have this problem, and they go beyond it anyway, and they shouldn't, is my body won't. I, I can't move. I, I, I feel self-conscious when I try to do stuff like that. Cause, so, you know, you hate to go out there and start dancing, and the person next to you start doing flips and spinning. And I just... Yeah, but you don't have to worry about the other people. See, I've heard this all before, you know. Different artists come to me, and they approach me to teach them to dance, and then they say, but I have two left feet. And I, you Janet know, Jackson said that? No, Janet didn't say that. But uh, some other people... ZZ Top, they might have said that. Well, they said that they'd be much more comfortable with the upper body. You want to start with the upper body? What about Eddie Murphy? I want to hear about these other people then. What about Eddie Murphy you know, and Arsenio? But wait, Eddie and Arsenio would be jealous if they saw you dancing, because they never wanted to try that African dance in coming to America. And if you did it... I can do the African dance. Well, let's show it. I, but I see, I, I had a knee injury. Oh, God. And, uh, well, take go. a look at this video while I see my knee. I hurt my knee oh, and my no. elbow. So I... The, the. And then after I hurt my knee, I had a... We're going to move on because we'll be here all night talking about knee problems. Bother right? me, too. Come on. Just let's start with the upper body. Okay. ZZ Top stuff. Okay. Give me your hands here. Move them this way. I feel stupid already. But it's okay. Please You're supposed down here, to. I don't want to put them in front of your face like this. That's right. That's right. Okay. Now grab your hand. Turn it into your face. Go back. Like this? There you go. That's it? See, that wasn't hard, was What's it? What's the name of that dance? The Velcro Fly. The Velcro Fly? I can mm -hmm. see that now. Ahmad Velcro Fly Rashad. Happy New Year. I'm Paul Abdul. I'm this handsome guy. I'm Ahmad Rashad, and stay tuned, we'll be right back. All right, Paul, before we get to a string of hits of yours, these are your dancers. Could you introduce them and tell them that if any of them goes down with an ankle injury or anything, that I have been practicing, I may be able to take place. Oh, you have to practice a long time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. So these are my talented dancers that are on the road with me. Um, we have Dominic here, who, who toured with Michael Jackson on the Bad Tour, but now I got him. <laughs> we got Bill Bull here, who works with me a lot. And we have Gigi Hunter, who used to be a, a solid gold dancer. <laughs> and we have Denise over here, who used to be a Dean Martin gold digger. No. <laughs> Arsenio Hall's in straight up? Uh, yes, Arsenio Hall's in straight up. Can't dance the lick? Oh, uh, oh. Arsenio can dance, and he did, he did the signatory. Oh, if I work on that, can I be like in the next one? <laughs> I swear honored. I will. I'd be honored. Keep this piece of tape, please. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to straight up. I'm Paul Abdo. This is the modern side. We're double teaming on you on Friday night videos, so stay tuned. Who's the, the rest of your band here? Great. Well, right here we have Sir Wells Christie, who lays down all those great sounds. He played with Hall and Oates, and he also played with George Michael on the Faith Tour. And here we have Mr. Jeffrey Suttles on drums. Right here we have 
Mr. Dayron Johnson on keyboards. This guy is going to be an incredibly famous person. He's unbelievable on keyboards. But the one thing that really bothers me about him is that he actually paid a publicist to tell me <laughs> that he was my boyfriend and you're not. Anyway. He was confused also with the record. Thought she was singing to him. Wrong again. He also has an interesting uh, story about a trumpet, but we don't have we time don't have for that. We have time for that. <laughs> and right over here we have Mr. Rafael Padilla from the Miami Sound Machine, but he's now with Paul Abdul for now. And I'm very excited. And he is the only witness here that has seen me sing yeah. and dance. We work yeah. together. Huh? Glad, he, huh, glad he got to see you. I certainly didn't. Oh, we so. later, 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 we'll do that. But right now, let's go to Cold Hearted. Could you introduce these lovely people here with you? I'd love to. These, these are my, this is my posse. <laughs> <laughs> the posse. <laughs> oh, God. Now, this is, this is the talented Dave Barry from Minneapolis on guitar. And I'm telling you guys, you have to come to the concert to see this man move. Uh, he's got some fast foot work happening. <laughs> right? The yeah. Minneapolis yeah, thing? Yeah, it's, it's one of those Minneapolis things. That's we, right. We saw right. a lot earlier. That's right. I'm moving out of Yeah, we all saw a mod earlier. In yeah. fact, we should take some lunch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, going on, uh, we have the lovely, talented Nadir Ali, and she has the most wonderful voice. She's singing in my band, and when she gets going, it's like the band has to take the towels. And so the band is down because uh, her voice Thank is pretty amazing. Oh, you're welcome. I know you paid me the money. <laughs> You've been paid well. <laughs> this man, the Hugh Hefner, friend of Hugh Hefner, like, uh, is Rocky Harris from Minneapolis, also playing bass. Guys, Casual. crazy. Casual clean. <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> All right, as we move on now to Forever Your Girl. Modern shot dance. You better stay tuned because he's gonna get up and dance. I'm gonna, you know, try. Well, I'm gonna at least try. I'm coming to America. Yeah, yeah. Kay. Okay. Okay. Move your arms. You're gonna, you can move your arm right arm up. Then God, the left arm up. So stupid. Then you can take it center. God. And you take two jerks for it. Jerk, jerk. <laughs> We're well on our way here. I can see it now. It is on Friday night videos. You know, in the 70s, the hottest thing coming out of Miami was the Miami Dolphins. <laughs> no longer. The hottest thing coming out of Miami now is Gloria Estefan. Yeah, she is hot. She's, you know, she's got that quality in her voice. A lot of people say that it reminds them of um, Karen Carpenter. She's got a beautiful voice. And I'm proud to say that I got a chance to meet her. She's a lovely lady. And I'm even more proud to say that one of her band members is a band member of my own. Rafael Padilla, he plays the percussion. Yeah. Time flies when you're having fun. It sure does. It's been a lot of fun. I've enjoyed it. We've got to do it again. You want to do it again? Yes, I would love to. Let's do it again. All right, good night. Good night. <laughs>